Seeing a city from the air can often give us a new perspective on the structures many of us see and use every day. This oddly shaped building near the heart of downtown Atlanta, Georgia, goes back to the city's railroad past. It was one of several roundhouses constructed in and around the city. Built in 1925, the building was part of Southern Railway's North Avenue yards. This was during the heyday of railroads in America, and the roundhouse was used to service steam engines for Southern's famous passenger trains. From the air, you can see the 18 stalls where engines would be parked and serviced. In the center of the facility, a clever piece of engineering called a turntable helped workers spin the locomotives from track to track. Today, that part of the property's history is long gone, but about 90 miles from Atlanta, in Somerville, Georgia, this turntable is still going strong. It was originally built in 1916 to serve a 36-stall roundhouse in Birmingham, Alabama, and was moved to Somerville in 1999. The turntable here now operates for visitors and guests traveling on the Tennessee Valley Railroad Museum's excursion trains. These days, turntables and roundhouses have been phased out. In the late 1940s and early 1950s, the steam era ended and diesel locomotives began to dominate. That, combined with the rise of cars and trucks as new methods of travel and shipping, meant servicing facilities like this one were no longer needed. Trying to compete with the trucking industry, Southern Railway turned this roundhouse into a warehouse that allowed shippers to store less than carload freight until it was ready to be shipped by truck. In 2002, it was transformed once again into North Yard's business park, and it's now home to dozens of Atlanta companies. The building is currently on the National Register of Historic Places and is a testament to Atlanta's railroad past and proof of its value in American history.